divorce, anger management, sexual predators, these are all tough topics for a parent, no doubt, to uh, tackle with their kids. But one children's author is making those sensitive issues a lot easier to cope with, a lot easier to communicate. Julia Cook is the author of books like Bully Beans, which teaches kids how to deal with bullying. Her books are among the top-selling children's books on Amazon, and this week she's here in town speaking to parents and kids at Chicago schools. Welcome, Julia. Thanks Thank for you. being here. Such important issues. Every parent probably wonders what's the right way to t talk to your kids about them, but we, the books we have, help. We have so much to teach kids and so little time, and if right. you read a child a book, you can get into their head. And if the book includes some positive po problem-solving strategies, then they become better problem solvers, which is our goal. So one of your books is called Scoop. That gets a lot of buzz. Parents obviously find this very helpful. It's about not getting kidnapped, and it's about teaching kids to be smarter than the scoopers and not afraid. So you you call them scoopers, the kidnappers, and often the scoopers don't look like evil people no, out of like No, they look just like strange regular movies. people. They don't look like strangers, you know, because they, they look normal. Yeah. And that's the important part to tell them. So you also brought along two pets I with did. you. I don't know if we can see um, them on I camera can here. Them. Um, they, um, Jake and Angus, they come out. I teach kids not to go up to dogs. Because that's often because a way scoopers that's go right. after exactly. kids. Yeah, that's right. They will. And I say, you wouldn't go up to a dog, would you, if you weren't with your mom? And they say, no. And I say, really? And then I pull them out and they say, oh. And I say, no. See, a scooper's not going to pick an ugly dog to trick you. They'll pick the cutest dog they can. Well, so. they are so darling, so too. Fun. These would work. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, how, obviously, books cannot teach alone these lessons, but these are no. starting points for people. Right. I, I mean, you might have a child who doesn't listen and follow instructions, but you read a book to them, and the kid doesn't do it either. So they identify with the child, and then the child learns to listen and follow instructions. Uh, I have one on boogers, because everybody has boogers, and some people don't know what to do with them. Mm -hmm. um, divorce. Boogers. The one, the D word, I didn't cause this, I can't control it, so I'm going to have to cope with it. And just because, you know, your parents are getting divorced doesn't mean you should divorce school. Yeah. You know? Bullying is also a yes, topic you target much. because and there's so much attention to that right now because I think a lot of people say back in my day that wasn't a big deal, but now right. with the digital world and social media, <laughs> bullying has taken on a whole new Cyberbullying, especially, that's bullying without boundaries, but 85% of our kids are bystanders. So if you want to fix this problem, you got to work with that group. Mm -hmm. And a bully is only a bully if they have the power of the other kids to back them up. So if we can teach our bystanders to unite right. and work together. Julia Cook, it's great to see you. Thanks for Thank stopping you. by Good Day Chicago. And you can find your books. Amazon, JuliaCookOnline.com. And I can do autograph copies that way. And all of them are sold on Amazon as well. Nice. So. Awesome stuff. To, Thank uh, you. Launching point for parents to teach their kids about important issues. Thank you, Julia. Thanks.